Okay, guys, here's my little uh, uh, table candle Mach 2 that I'm playing around with, and I added a little uh, shade kind of thing to it. And today I put a 12 volt lead acid battery in it, and I was able to charge it up with that little 2 watt solar panel that I've used in a lot of my videos. And it worked just fine. So this is pretty much uh, what I've been looking for. It's a light that you can use at night. And I can uh, I can turn it up and down in brightness if I want to. It's real bright. Or turn it way down if I want it down. But anyway, it, it was successful. It worked quite well, and uh, I like the way it's set up. Now, I ran it last night just to try it out on that 9-volt battery in there. It's a alkaline battery. And I was very disappointed. It only ran about six hours on that battery, and I was expecting to get two or three times that. But those little 9-volt batteries <coughs> on this type of power drain don't work very well. So anyway, I went to this... Uh, 12 volt lead acid and it's just a, what it is it's a it's a radio shack um, 12 volt uh, 20 or 2000 uh, milliamp per hour battery I got it on sale at radio shack after the holidays and it worked out quite well for this little application and then uh, uh, like I say I, I using this little uh, 2 watt solar panel during the day to uh, charge it up with and that works quite well but something else I wanted to show just for fun was there's enough light coming out of this <coughs> that it actually has a feedback loop just with the light from that light on that panel. There's uh, 2 to 3 volts coming off of the light onto that panel. And a long time ago some of us were talking about getting a feedback from the uh, CFL project with the solar panels. There's a little bit. It's not much. It might uh, trickle charge something. But uh, anyway, I thought I might show that. But anyway, this little project was successful. I like this little uh, table light idea. And uh, it's kind of cute. It's fun. And uh, it's something that I'll use now that I know that I can charge it up with the solar panel during the day and run it uh, as long as I want to at night. And it's self-sustaining. You would never have to do anything to it. You just... Uh, during the day, hook up that panel and in, in uh, really in light, in just plain daylight, there's enough coming off of that because the type of panel that it is, it'll charge up that uh, lead acid battery there quite nicely. And uh, this thing only uses uh, such a small amount of power, depending on how you dial it up, that uh, for nighttime use, unless you ran it all the time, would be all you'd need. So, anyway. Very successful little project. My little uh, table candle mark two.